<coughs> Hi here, I've got a torn speaker. What somebody's done, they've doped around the outside of the speaker and it's got brittle and it's torn or got broken. I've repaired it once before. So what I'm going to do is repair this speaker. Get a Sally's. Bit of tissue paper. And a paintbrush. So, uh, might just zoom in a little bit for you. Zoom in, get in a bit closer for you. Nice to bring that back a bit. And that'll back a wee bit for you. Right now. Let's see if I can do this on its side. What I want to do is try and get my finger behind the speaker. Give me a finger behind the speaker cone and try and get that level again. I've just got my finger behind there firmly, rubbing on the speaker cone to try and meld it together type of sort of thing. Instead of trying to just join the two joints together unevenly that just wouldn't be right so persevere with me for a minute that's looking pretty good to me you can see what I've done there I put my finger behind there firmly under the cone rubbing it together. Oh no, and now for the hard part. I'll get some uh, glue. Excuse me for waving gear around in front of you here, but that's the way it is. I might just put a bit on the bit of wood here first. Right. This stuff dries clear. Don't be afraid to slap it about. Like all good cooking shows, I've already cut a little piece to suit the thing. see the ridges in the cone here you get the bit more glue we'll paste it down first a bit first sorry folks I'm mucking around not enough glue Look at Like I say, don't worry about putting too much glue on there. Of course, it's PVA, it's like a, a skin. So, I'm going to chance the whole job and fuck it up right in front of everybody by putting another layer of tissue on it 
finished right away. It's a bit fiddly. I need to break the fucking break this layer of tissue. I've had to gently work that one, had to recover that. So it might look like a bit of a mess at the moment, but that'll all dry clear. It's a pretty big patch, that one, actually. I should have just went with the one layer, I think, but I've done it now. That's it, I've done it now, so she looks like a pretty... Now, I should have just stuck with the one layer of tissue but you get that. So as soon as this old speaker's old and everything and all this around here is brittle I'm gonna I'm gonna um paint this whole speaker with PVA glue around the outsides here. And uh I'm gonna be using it to play harmonica with anyway so it will change the tone of the speaker. Got a pretty light, wimpy fucking turn there. That didn't work. But like that anyway. But uh, well, the best thing would be to do is to let that dry and. Uh, Give you a look at it when it's dry, but uh, the sun's going down and the fucking dogs are coming out and the hounds are starting to fucking howl and all that other shit. So what I'm going to do is get around the paint and all this around here from around, from down there, around that whole ring there. So that's what I'm up to. So I'll give you a look at that little patch when I fucking finish with it. But what I'll do is spin around and give you another. I, I put a patch on it once before. As you can see, there's a patch I did, did once before on it. That was right on the edge. But that was only one layer of tissue. I've gone two layers of tissue on the other one I've just done here, but I've only put one layer of tissue on there. Doesn't look as lumpy. I don't know how that one is going to come out a bit lumpy, but oh well. I've done the two layers on it now, so I'll live with it. And like I said, I was going to uh, dull this speaker up a bit. Like I said before, just by painting PVA around the whole structure there. From there around, that'll be in conjunction with that other thing I've just done there. 
and that'll come around to me now. So I'll get back to you on this one, folks. So yeah, hang in there. Here we are back in the shed. Continue on with that speaker repair job I did earlier on. So we'll just uh, turn around and uh, see what's going on here, folks. Alright. <coughs> now, as I said before, it had been doped around the outside. And what I was going to do, I've covered the whole surface now with PVA glue to try and prevent it from splitting anymore because it was hardened out here and the PVCA will give it a plastic film like bond to stop it from um, splitting I hope there's a, a repair I did earlier on on this speaker previously give you a close in look on that yeah, that was just done with the tissue paper, but that was only one layer of tissue paper. Nice and strong, the PVA glue gives it its strength. Depending on how many coats you put on. Right now, now here's the uh, patch I did earlier on. So there's a look at it. It'll eventually clear up a bit better, but I'll give you, I'm trying to get you a good close look in there. See, you know, I got it to mould into the the groove of the speaker, so there's not a funny looking lump there or anything. And, uh, The tissue started to break a bit as there you can see, but I recovered it well. And did the same there. But like I said, I've done two layers on that one. There's not a problem there. It depends on how, how strong you want to make it, you know, if you're a bit bit worried you can put another layer of PVA glue over it later on if you want, but that's about it, but as you can see, it's a bit overzealous I do think with the extra layer on there, but that's what you get. But it's worked. Now you're not going to see that behind the speaker grill cloth. And like I say, that was a that was one I did oh, a couple of months ago. That one. All the whiteness is gone out of it. And that's the one I did a while ago. So that's the speaker, all in all. Like I say, all this around here is PVA glue now. Or on the outside to about here was dope, doped, whatever they fucking want to call it. But now to try and prevent this speaker from splitting, it's got PVA, a nice sort of rubbery type fucking film on it. Test of the patch. I wouldn't do that if there was in the condition it was in before. So there you go, I hope I've helped you out a bit. You can recover those old speakers. So there you go, that's it, that's my bag. It's a simple little trick you can try to have, folks. <laughs>